Hi everyone, I am BM and I'm back again for the episode. It's been a while since the last time I uploaded some episodes. And before we continue the ethical hacking tutorial from scratch to advance, I'm going to give you a bonus bonus video and this video and these two videos will give um give you gonna I will gonna give you goosebumps. <laughs> Well, in today's video, I'm going to, to teach you how to access dark web step by step. And I'm going to give you all the updated links inside the dark web and the official links inside the dark web. But um, um, just to be sure, note this just to be sure for your safety, do not download any applications. Do not download yet any applications. Do not uh, process any anything inside the dark web just safely browse and browse but do not click or download anything and do not be tempted all right so you're on your own um, this is all for educational purposes only so let's just get started I'm just going to simply going to go to my here we are in the video um, we are at the VMware. I'm using a VMware outside the video before you before you going to use the VMware before you going to use the dark web. Uh, it would be better if you you go to um, you go to this one. Okay, let's search Firefox. You're going to do this outside. You're going to do this outside the VM, the virtual machine outside the Kali Linux. So you're going to use this in the wind in your Windows or the uh, that depends what operating system are you using. Um, this is not the safest. This is not the safest thing to do, but this will give us an extra credit to just to be sure to be safe. So siphon for Windows. You just download it. And after the download, just click and next, 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 and then start. And that's done. And then you open the virtual machine, and then you start the Kali Linux. And then let's get just started. So as for the dark web, let's go to the torkali.org. And inside, you just go, you just simply download the, ah no, tour download, tour download. Sorry that. Tour download 64 bit, so that depends on what bit are you using in your operating system. Then click the download tool for browser. That depends. You choose your language. There are too many languages in here, but as for me, I'm going to use the English. I'm going to use. I'm using Windows, so it's Windows 64 bit. If you're using Mac OS, you use 64 bit Mac OS. If you're using Linux, you're going to just use either 32 bit or 64 bit. But as I'm using Alright, I'm using Kali Linux, so I downloaded it already. I'm going to check it. You just need to click it. Go to the downloads. And then here. So how are you going to check it? So let's just click the box and then it will automatically go to its folder. There. This is the downloaded this is the downloaded uh, Tor browser. Let's extract it again. I've already extracted it, but let's do it again. Um, just wait for a couple of minutes. Alright. It's done. And then, go to the browser. Go to this folder. Click, and go to the browser. And look for Start Tour Browser. And open leap pad. Go to search. Fine. And this will solve the problem if you're going. If you're. If you're. If you know how to access the Tor browser and have some difficulties or have some problems, this will solve your problem. And search for root. Find. And the root. You see the zero. This is not a programming language. So. Don't expect me to, this is not a programming language, so don't expect me to teach you um, how does it work. So just change the zero on the, on the video, just change the zero into one, 
and then save it close and then open your terminal in the terminal go ls to see um, and go to the downloads cd downloads ls again and then cd cd will go to the browser will open the browser um my wa copy and then ls again so how are you going to start it just simply that code and then copy this one oh copy that one and then paste it wait for it and then it's done oh i mean this is uh, since this is not the first time that i configure it so it automatically redirects me into the browser itself but if you're the first if you're first time to this um there will be a connect and a configure you go to the configure you go to the bridge one and, the, and click what country i just choose and then connect that's it so as for the link i have thousands of links in here thousands now i have hundreds of links in here these are the updated links for the tor browser let's check it yeah facebook in here is it safe no that ants of course this uh this is different from the real facebook and this facebook is what we use in the dark now so. and there are too many links in here service email for markets if you want to buy okay i'm not gonna explain that the censored Darknet website, market sites, dark web wallets, onion, bitcoins. If you want to go, um, how are you gonna? How are you going to pay? How are you going to buy using the uh, in the darknet? Uh, we don't use PHP since I'm a Filipino in Philippines. We don't use USD or any other. We use bitcoins. So if you want to go for that and then search for your own at your own risk. And this is it. Email services fun and games, social sites, if you want to hacking, if you want to learn more about the hacking well, file text and hosting and many other just post it, okay? if you want, if you, if, if you really want to know about this I mean, this is too confidential for me to do so I'm not sure if this is alright but then if you really want to learn more then just surf just surf and surf never stop surfing and learning all right so that's all for the dark web um like i said this is not the safest way to do so this is not the i'm just i just teach you how to simply access the dark web on my next video i'm going to teach you how to become completely anonymous thanks